got this. You got this, girl. Come on. Show them why you're an amateur thief. Good night. No way. No flipping way I didn't see that coming. What a fancher. How, how in the hell did one more fight lose over a kiss? <laughs> Now, before we start, I got a love for both Marvel and DC, but I'm really concerned to see who's going to win this one. Superheroines. Millions have been drawn to these modern myths of comic book lore. Or you could uh, just be drawn to the way they're drawn. Like Anna Marie, the Rogue. And Diana Prince, the Wonder Woman. He's Boomstick and I'm Wizard. And we're here to watch two chicks duke it out. Cat fight! It's our job to analyze their weapons, armor, and skills. And maybe a few other things. To find out who would win a death battle. Rogue has possessed a variety of different powers over the years. For this duel in particular, we will use the most well-known version, the original iteration from the comics and television show. Her deadliest weapon is her own skin. With just a touch, she absorbs a person's memories, talents, personalities, and abilities. Whether super- It's crazy to see how Raj with her power of gym and super scream is no joke. Alright? But then, the Wonder Woman, literally a goddess, this is going to be wild. The one way I got it, I added on Prince, like, and got the last of true. Now, this is gonna be crazy to see, like, how woman uh, Billy can offend against Raw's ability. Superhuman or not, to use them herself. Too bad it knocks him out cold. And if she holds on long enough. <laughs> It's game over. Tenacious foes oh, like yeah, Juggernaut yeah. can resist it, but in the end, nobody is safe from Rogue's parasitic touch. For every second of contact, Rogue can keep these powers for a full minute, though sometimes there's unforeseen side effects. She held on to Miss Marvel for so long, she absorbed her powers permanently. Now she's got she super strength, speed, and near invulnerability. Damn. Now that I blame her, though, <laughs> I'd be holding on to Miss Marvel for as long as I could. Right, right, she also gained a seventh sense, the ability to subconsciously predict her opponent's moves. But her seventh sense doesn't seem to always work. That or the writers just forgot about it, cause uh, Rogue gets her ass kicked a lot. For plot convenience. And damn, she's got a hot ass. What? Hey, that counts as a superpower in my book, Wiz. But while she's not invincible, she doesn't have any real weaknesses either. She's a glassy southern belle who I'd like to take out to dinner. Who can fly, lift buildings, and kill people just by touching them. Never mind. Ain't that enough? To the uneducated nerd, Wonder Woman may seem a cheap clone of Superman. With super boobies! But in reality, she's a whole different story. Created from Earth, born by gods, trained by ancient warriors. Maker of Wonder Bread, designer of the Wonder Bra. Boomstick, that's not true. See, I can do too, is. Wonder Woman is the incredibly powerful and near-invincible ambassador of Themyscira and self-appointed protector of the Earth. And she dresses like a stripper, a patriotic yeah. stripper. Diana Prince has been trained by the Em- Fun fact. Do you know one woman can lift thorns, hammers, that's crazy, and rod steal power? She unpredictable. They all know it? If y'all didn't, look look up. Look up and look it up and see can one woman will throw up uh hammer or look up and see do Ross he steal people power? Look up. Amazons is a master combatant since childhood. She dueled the best of the best for the right to be crowned Wonder Woman. Her unearthly powers are divine, granted by ancient Greek gods and goddesses. From Demeter, she receives hey, superhuman strength and durability. And you know that bitch mailman god with the wingy shoes? Hermes? Whatever. He gave Wonder Woman Ooh, the ability to fly and move at hypersonic uh -oh. speed. She was given numerous other powers I mean, from the enhanced senses, somebody. animal rapport, and blessings of wisdom and empathy. Aside from the obvious cannons resting right below her neck, she's got a free- Now before they finish, what they be telling you about Wonder Woman, y'all be thinking that Wonder Woman might win it. Now, I can't lie. One more might win this. I don't know. But Raj, I don't know. I might go a little more to Raj, but 
I gotta see! Let a woman look like she might win this fight! Pretty bizarre mix of weaponry. Her lasso of truth is a piece of unbreakable string that, well, makes it tell the truth. And what yeah, other that, great like, thoughts like, must you be thinking? She, uh, God, your actually, daughter's got a nice rack. Hell yeah, yeah she does! Yeah, you she got, uses you got, you got, like, a long-range no throwing no weapon, what, using its razor-sharp edge to slice open what, her what, enemy's what, throat. What, Wonder what, Babe here wears the bracelets of submission, indestructible steel gauntlets forged from the remains of Zeus's legendary Aegis. These babies can block all sorts of attacks. She has persevered throughout the years, fighting a huge variety of foes, even killing the Greek god of war, Ares. Hear that, Kratos? A chick beat you to it. Let them see you smile now. Okay, okay, okay. Imagine if Roy tried to influence Batman, uh, um, a uh, gear game, and she just, she just end up with a ultimate belt. Like, yeah, like, where she tried to, like, want, uh, Batman gear, and end up with just a uh, ultimate belt that don't make no sense. Like, let's, let, let, let's uh, figure it out. Let's see, let's see. Come on, um, no, no, you got this, you got this, girl? Come on, show them why you're an amateur on Good night. No way, no flipping way I didn't see that coming. What a finisher. How, how in the hell did one more fight lose over a kiss? How are you about to lose over a kiss? Ah, kiss! You about to lose on the kids? Like, wow, I thought, I thought, I thought for sure one more was going to win after that uh, dream. Like after one more got her, got her power dream, I thought one more was going to come back and, and, and uh, win the whole fight. Like, come on. Woohoohoo! This goes down in history as the best death battle ever! Poor Wonder Woman was more than a match for Rogue, but then she touched Rogue's face. Wonder Woman is a trained fighter, so naturally she would strike her opponent's weakest spots like the neck, stomach, joints, and, well, the face. In the end, her failure was a result of her thorough Amazonian training. And her stripper outfit. Her leg was just begging to be grabbed there. Though personally, uh, I might have grabbed elsewhere. Wonder Woman's powers may be godly, but Rogue's taken it similar powers before, too. so there's no reason to say she couldn't hear. Adding Wonder Woman's strength and speed to Rogue's own power gave her a huge advantage, drastically oh, turning the tide. Wow. A few high flying how, combos uh, uh, and our favorite uh, uh, X-Girl had Wonder Woman uh, on the uh, rope. And with her combined was. reflexes speed and seventh sense, she outmaneuvered Wonder Woman with one fatal kiss. Rogue sure made out in this fight. The winner is Rogue. That fight was insane. I get why Wonder Woman lost her combat skill and good look. Screen are just too much. Like, I can see why one woman lost. Like, my favorite part was when Raj drained one more power. That was just a crazy moment. And when Raj going kiss one woman to get one way down, like, bro, how you, how you finish a, a, a little pony with a kiss? Who finished the pony with your kiss? Oh, come on. Thanks for watching me freak out over Raj in one woman. Let me know in the comment who you thought won. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and search the next battle for me. So you won't miss episode 234 of Death Battle.